everyone i hope you guys are okay as you can see here this is the brand new um 145s idea pad from lenovo the reason today i'm here to talk about the windows 10 s mode if you buy any new laptop from uh, pc world or anywhere windows launch uh windows 10 s mode okay so windows 10 s mode is completely designed just to control the installation which is not from the you know microsoft app store if you want to download anything you can download but if you want to install any program or any software which is from third party website or third party publisher you can't do that so in that way windows declare like this is for more security so in that way your windows doesn't get affected from the malware viruses and stuff like that but there is one problem if you try to install any other program that you wish to do you can't do that but there is one way without any charges you can log out from this mode and you can go back to uh, basic windows home windows 10 home version or windows 10 pro version free of charge but one thing you must need to remember this is only one way so if you come out from the s mode then you can't go back to s mode okay so today in this video i'm going to show you how to do that it's not going to be take more than two three minutes it's super simple so stay with us and check how to get rid of this s mode to windows 10 pro mode or home mode thank you all right so as you can see here this is the lenovo idea pad does not matter which model and brand all right so this computer this is right now windows 10 in s mode I did explain already what is S mode is. So now we'll try to get out from this mode and get into Windows 10 Home Edition. Okay, there is an opportunity to do that, but make sure you know that once you're done, you can switch back to Windows S mode. Okay, so what you need to do first, go to the search box, which is in, right here, write it down settings. As you can see go to the settings app double click and from here if you go down if you scroll down you're gonna see updates and security the bottom one double click on it okay. so from here as you can see there is an activation option which is that one once you click here then they are explaining here like switch to Windows home, Windows 10 home okay what you need to do you need to go to the store which is the app store from Microsoft as you can see here switch out of S mode you don't need to do nothing make sure you connect it to internet and this page is open up click get and it's going to download the necessary files and folders to switch back to Windows 10 home mode so as you can see this is uh, downloading okay all right you're all set so within couple of minutes it depend on your computer strength and obviously the network strength as well it, what it says you are all set so you have switched out of S mode and can now install apps from outside of Microsoft Store which is the message I'm going to say close okay and I'm going to close it let's close it back and I'm going to restart the system so if there is any any issue it's going to be resolved okay that's how simple it is to get out from a small all right the system is restarting now. all right so the system already restarted let's get into it so let's hit enter with the password it's going to start back so now there is no more s mode how are we going to check it click on the properties and double check what it says all right as you can see here it says windows 10 home now whatever you like to install you can okay uh, there would not be any more security and asking just to uh, You know Install all this program just from the app store, which is from Microsoft Now you are no more in control. You can you are in more control 
by yourself you can download and install any third party program into this machine okay so in this video i would like to explain this issue uh, it does not limited to any specific model any model any brand if that is comes with windows 10 s mode then you can switch out like that to home and still if you do have any question regarding this make sure you leave it in the comment section and i'll be more happy to reply you as soon as possible and thank you so much for watching guys i hope i'll see you in the next video bye for now